Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Chase of Rocky Mountain. Thank you so much for checking in. So today we have the Bionic Plus V2 protection jacket from Alpine Stars. This is one of the latest additions to the protection jacket lineup. Now price on this one, you're gonna be right around $200. So it sits between the Bionic Tech V2 and then their Bionic Action. So we do have product spotlights on those as well. So watch those if you wanna learn all about those. And I will talk about kind of where this fits into that lineup and the differences between the three as I go through and we talk about this. But what's nice about the Bionic Plus, the fitment is good. It's relatively low profile considering how much coverage that you're getting. Your CE level two in the chest, the back, level one in the shoulders and the elbows. Now, as far as the fitment goes, so Michael is about five foot 10, about 175, 180 pounds. He's wearing a size large. So use him as a sizing reference. Now he could, if he wanted to, if he felt like this large was a little bit too snug, he wanted just a little bit more room, Michael could wear the size extra large, but he just felt like the large is a size that he felt was gonna be best for him. We do have our fit guarantee. If you buy one of these, if you don't like how it fits, you can send it back to us in brand new unused condition. We wanna make sure that you get the size that is gonna be best for you. So we give you free shipping both ways on that first exchange. All right, so diving into this. So the base material on the Bionic Plus V2 is gonna be a comfortable moisture wicking fabric. Again, you can see it's got a lot of mesh on here to help this thing breathe. And like I said, overall, considering with the shoulders, the elbows, chest, back, it's relatively low profile. So the jersey that you have right now, it's probably gonna fit over top of this, but keep in mind, you know, if you're buying one of these and the jersey that you currently own is maybe like more of an athletic fit, then you might wanna consider going up one size with your jersey. So just something to keep in mind there, but we do like the fit. Now you've got these adjustment straps right here around the waist, and you notice that you have these two straps right here on the top of the chest. These really aren't adjustment straps. Really what they're there for is just to kind of help support this chest protector and kind of keep it held up where it needs to be, but they're not gonna be adjustable. But Mike, when he put this on, he said you do need to unbuckle these to put it on because the zipper right here is, is located on the left side. So you'd undo this left strap, undo the zipper, and then put it on that way. Now, as far as the coverage and the protection goes, that's what you're investing here. So the chest protector, what they're using is their cell technology, front and rear. It's kind of a hybrid design. And I like this setup because you can see you're level two certified, so really good impact protection. But what's nice though is that you can see the cell technology, it has so much, so many cutouts that it's gonna get a good job of, of ventilation and airflow going right through that. Now you have the hard plastic on the outside, but then underneath you can see that red, that's actually a really dense foam just to help with even more impact protection. So again, CE level two, and you have this foam here that is around the outside just for some added comfort as well. Now something kind of unique, unique with the Bionic Plus, and you see this with the Bionic Tech V2, it's kind of a hybrid style because you notice that right here with the sides, where these straps connect, it's like a just standard chest protector with these side pieces here. If you look at the Bionic Action, that one's a little bit different where the whole chest piece is sewn into the front. And one of the differences that Alpine Stars was talking about is they feel like with this design here, it's just gonna offer a little bit more mobility since you do have this that's able to move a little bit freely of the base versus being sewn into the actual chest. So that's one of the major differences between this and the Bionic Action. And with the Bionic, it's gonna be level one chest so and the back. So just something to keep in mind there. But Michael, quarter turn, lift up the arm for me. So here you can see it wraps around just a little bit. Here's your connector, plenty of adjustability there. Put that down. The shoulder pads on here. Now these are not removable, but you are CE level one here. Again, you've got that foam underneath, and then you've got elbow protection here, level one, that is just sewn into the protector itself. All right, face to the back for me. Now the back protector here, again, you're utilizing that cell technology, and again, they're calling it that hybrid design because you've got that plastic here, but then you can see all that dense red foam that is underneath there. And something that they're kind of talking about that they like with this design is, Michael, turn just a little bit more for me. You can see how well the shape of this actually fits the contour of Michael's back. And that is one thing about this that I do like, as you can see, it just kind of fits the curve well. And then down here, when you get to the kidney belt that is built in, you actually go to a soft rubber down here at the very bottom. That way it's not gonna be digging into the bottom there. But again, you've got good coverage here. Now, one thing I will point out is that with the Bionic Tech V2, that one you do go up in price. But looking at the two, you notice that the Bionic Tech V2 is going to offer more coverage on the back. The back protector is just gonna be a little bit larger on the back there. All right, Michael, face back to the front. 
Now, last thing I do want to talk about, and again, this is something that I was kind of surprised that Alpine Stars did, is you notice that there's no shoulder straps on here and they don't have their neck brace tabs. So that's kind of rare for Alpine Stars to do that, where they're not giving those, those brace on tabs for their neck brace compatibility. Doesn't mean you can't wear a neck brace with this, but you're not gonna have those tabs there. And with the back piece there, it is pretty low profile, so I still feel like it's gonna work. But you look at other ones that they have, they'll actually have an insert that's removable at the top of the back protector just to give the best fitment possible with their neck brace. So a couple things to note there. And lastly, the only thing that I noticed about this that I felt like maybe they could improve upon is the chest protector here. We just felt like it sat kind of low. We just felt like you kind of had this whole area up here around the collarbone and the upper chest just a little bit more exposed than I or Michael personally would want. But overall, again, you've got great coverage front, CE level two, great coverage in the back, shoulder and elbow protection. So overall, again, if you're shopping for one of these, you look at this, you kind of see where it fits price-wise, and you got to ask yourself, you know, what kind of coverage do you want? What CE level ratings are going to be most important to you? And that'll kind of help you decide between this, the Bionic Tech V2, and the Bionic Action. But if you have questions or comments, though, we would love to get those answers to so make sure leave those down below. To grab one of these and to watch the other product spotlights, you can click on the links or just head to rockymountatvmc.com. As always, we ship for free over 75 bucks. And if you like this video and you want to stay up to date on these, get subscribed to the Rocky Mountain YouTube channel and hit the notification bell. I am Chase, and we'll see you on the trails.